Okay, so I just came, I'm saying this for everyone's freedom and instruction. So I just came from Save On Foods, where the security guard approached me and said I was banned from the store because apparently some of the female employees in the store thought that I was looking at them and that it was making them uncomfortable, which is completely not true. I talked to the manager and everything was squared away fine, but the whole thing is demonstrative of people who are far from God. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, beautiful. Um, beautiful, thank you, Lord. And outside the Christian faith, okay, and so there is fear and impure minds. That's all it is. The Bible says to the pure, all things are pure, okay? But to those outside of Christ, do I even want to know what goes through the average brain? Not really, because I catch even the slightest wind of stuff like this, and I'm like, I don't want to know anymore. Like, I just... But quite frankly, folks, all of these people are wearing skin-tight black pants. And it's an epidemic. I'm like, I just watched a film... Now, I don't look at these people in any wrong way. Not at all. I appreciate the beauty of God in everyone, and my mind is completely 100% pure. But it's these girls that are outside of Christ that have a broken mindset that is very strange. It's like they are just fearful and like suspicious and yet they are wearing these skin tight pants and so they're trying to send me Anyways, you're just like, okay, let's just back this up. Everyone needs Christ on the inside in order to be a redeemed soul and a redeemed mind that is 100% pure and set free from sin. That means no fear, nothing but pure joy and pure love at all times. And stuff like this would never happen. Secondly, women would be wearing modest dress every single day. Like I just watched a video on YouTube of San Francisco and New York in like 1906 and 1911 respectively. And all the women were wearing full length dresses, completely modest, super dignified with hats and just very modest. And most people were probably Christian back then and things were just free and fearless and polite and friendly. Now, because of the distance from Christ, you have girls that are freaked out, weird minds. They probably watch weird media. They think corrupt things about every guy everywhere. They have weird thoughts going through their own brains. Now they're wearing masks on the job because they're told to do so. They're all wearing skin tight pants because the non-Christian media sold that to them. Now there's black security guards that are wearing masks, like clothed in all black. like. The manager comes up to me. He's wearing a black mask. The whole thing's like it feels like a creepy horror movie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, I'm filled with the Holy Spirit and so I know how to just be honest and real and just navigate these insane things. But this is what happens when the world forsakes Christ. You have unholy thinking and impure minds on the inside of people. And there's no way in 10,000 years that I was ever thinking even one thought of any impure form towards any female at any time. I appreciate the beauty of God in everyone everywhere. And God ordained all of us to be free to be able to look at people and enjoy each other's beauty. And if you can't handle that, you have a corrupted mind that is what is called by the Bible the unredeemed mind. It's called sinful nature apart from Christ and strangely you think that everyone everywhere is out to get you or oh my gosh, okay? So once again, these are just symptoms of a nation and a school system and people in general that are far from Christ. And I'm just making this video for my own therapy and satisfaction's sake because anytime I see something or experience something during my day that I know that is not from God, it behooves me to turn on this video camera and talk about it for everyone's freedom and my own satisfaction. There's also prophetic power 
in the spoken word. When you open your mouth and you speak against things in this world that you know are not from God, God is listening and he responds, okay? <laughs> so I'm just like, okay, every girl for all time should be Christian and filled with the Holy Ghost. That's zero fear, total purity, total love. Everyone should be wearing full-length dra full dresses or other, other, other modest clothing. There should be no secular music or any unholy products in any of these stores or work environments. There should be no need for any stupid satanic security guards wearing all black and wearing all black masks. No one should be commanded to wear a mask in the workplace that makes them feel completely uncomfortable and totally dehumanized. <sighs> like, you know... <laughs> you know, and certainly, you know, no customer... Enough said. Enough said, folks. These are all symptoms of people who are far from God, far from Christ, and not filled with the Holy Ghost. And I pray for everyone's freedom in this country and worldwide. Okay? In Christ, you're free from everything. You're free from everything. And the world is very beautiful to you. People are beautiful. Okay? You know how to dress beautiful, function beautiful, appreciate everyone, made in the image of God, okay? Um, you see the world and other people through God's eyes, not through selfish eyes, um, okay? Everything and everyone is an inspiration of worship to you, okay? Um, yeah, it's, that's it. So, yeah, I just like... I got to make videos about this stuff because these are um, nasty experiences, okay, um, that are just the result of uh, sin in the world. Um, that's not my fault, and I just want to make a video about it because I'm allowed to make a video about it. Um, it makes me feel better. Um, but once again, it just highlights um, the problems that we have in this country apart from uh, Christ and apart from a Christian education. I'm like, if the schools are not filled with the Bible and people aren't baptized in the Word of God, um, well, girls very well might be afraid of people. Like, it's just... It's all distance from Christ. I'm like, let's just, just back it up right to the beginning. <laughs> like, oh my goodness. Like, anytime there's dumb stuff like this, it's just like, get filled with Christ. Like, everything will be pure and beautiful to you. And you won't have any problems. And you'll just love everyone everywhere. And everything will be pure and beautiful to you. And life is awesome. Have a great day.